In this video I'm going to show you how to generate passive income in crypto even if you have no experience at all and even if you have very little capital. I'm gonna show you how to set up crypto trading bots on the Blockfin exchange. You can use this exchange from pretty much anywhere in the world with a VPN. It's a non-KYC exchange which means that you can use it from the US, you can use it from anywhere. The bots they offer are completely free, you don't have to pay a subscription or anything like that and you can do all of this without any prior experience and also even if you have very little money what you can see here is that i literally set up a bot yesterday on october 28th day is october 29th so i set up this bot yesterday i gave it very little money right 600 dollars of which 200 are still free so the bot only used 400 dollars so far and in one day it generated me 112 dollars in profit the bot does everything it buys it sells it places stop loss it does completely everything you can use such bots to generate income for yourself even if you have no experience in trading whatsoever right the bot is basically doing everything in this video i will show you step by step how to set up bots on the blockchain exchange you're gonna learn everything that you need to know all you gotta do is just watch until the very end of the video so obviously the first step that you have to take is to open a blockchain account there's gonna be a link around this video there's gonna be a link around this video if you register using our link, you guys are going to have the chance to win some additional tools and resources which are going to help you earn way more money than this. So you can either use our link or if you cannot find it, you can just go to blockfin.com and just make sure that when you go to the sign up page right here as the referral code you guys add sat income here so that's how you create an account you just add email password the referral code you agree to their terms and service and you sign up if you sign up with our link guys you just have to send us your id you can find it right here you can just copy it and you can email it to us or send it via whatsapp how do you do that well you can go to our website satsincome.com you can click this messenger like icon right here and you can either click this to send us an email or you can click this to send your user id via whatsapp by doing this you guys are gonna have the chance to win tools and resources like i already mentioned that's gonna help you make a lot of money with your bots i'm gonna give you more details about that at the end of the video now let's get to business so to set up your first trading bot all you have to do is navigate to the futures tab right here from the menu and select trading bot now at the moment of me recording this uh, there is only one option available right here and that's for signal but this is exactly the option that you need so no worries later in time there might be more options right here so what you're gonna have to select is signal bot that's the first thing the second thing that you guys have to do is to click right here on add signal you give your signal a name ideally this is gonna be the strategy that you're gonna be trading so in my case it's gonna be mmnp because that's the strategy that i'm gonna be using what is also good to add here is the time frame that you're gonna be trading so if for example you want to be trading a 15 minutes time frame you can add here a time frame there is a few to type here signal description there is no really need for you to do that and it's just optional so we're not gonna really do it then you have to click on next now here you're gonna see two very important things webhook url right you can easily copy it by clicking this button right here and alert message you can copy this as well by clicking this button you don't have to copy it now i'm just showing you we're actually gonna be using these two things later on in this video not right now for now you just have to click on complete right and your signal is gonna be right here the next step is to create a bot by the way keep in mind guys that you can have multiple signals right here so you can have signals for different strategies let me actually show you that before i show you how to create a bot let's say that you have another strategy and maybe you are using the rsi indicator for this strategy and you are trading the five minutes time frame right so you can create another signal click next you're gonna get again the webhook url and the alert message right here you have to click on complete and then bam you're gonna have here two different signals now wherever you want to set up a bot for your rsi strategy right you're just going to click on create a bot right here wherever you want to set up a bot for your other strategy you're going to click on create a bot right here now let me show you how to actually create a bot first of all you have to select the pair right you can see that there are a lot of pairs available right here what's important for you guys to understand is that at the moment of me recording this you cannot set multi pair bots you basically cannot set one bot that's going to be trading multiple cryptocurrencies you have to set up one bot for each coin that you want to be trading right so let's say that for your first bot you want to be trading bitcoin you're going to select it right here and you're going to click confirm the next thing that you guys have to do is select the leverage 
right here what leverage do you want to be using 1x 5x 10x 50x right you can use up to 150x should you do this well not at all ideally low leverage something like 5x is good right for my boss guys can see here that i set it up with 5x leverage right so you don't really have to go crazy and use high leverage in order to make money you see this bot is only trading with like 400 dollars at the moment right it has 200 dollars that are available right so total 600 dollars but it's trading only with 400 dollars at the moment it you know and it already generated 108 dollars in just one day so you don't really have to go crazy with the leverage because you can get liquidated and you can lose all of your money better use moderate amount of leverage right so you are safe the next thing that you guys have to do is to add here invested margin right how much money do you want to give these bots to trade with right so the minimum at the moment of mid this is 50 dollars you cannot set up a bot to trade with 10 dollars you gotta give it at least 50 dollars right in my case right here you guys can see that i gave this bot 600 dollars right so you can go above this it's just important for you to understand that you cannot give it less than 50 dollars lastly what you guys have to do right here is first of all uh, the entry settings you should keep the default settings which is basically trading view signal what this means is that the bot is gonna be getting signals when to enter and when to exit trades from trading view right and i'm gonna show you how this works in a moment for now you just have to remember that you have to keep here the default settings trading view signal then you have a couple more options right here multiple entry what this means is that if it's enabled the bot can enter multiple trades if it's disabled right the bot is only gonna enter once right and it's never gonna enter anymore even if it gets signals to do so right until the first trade is closed right only after that the bot will open a new position right so if you want the bots to have multiple entries right you have to enable this and also if you want to have take profit targets and if you want to have stop losses you should want to write especially the stop losses you guys have to enable this option right here as well and you guys have to add here a percentage stop loss what is important for you to know is that this percentage is going to be fixed right so if you add here let's say 0.5 percent this is going to be the stop loss for all of the trades that are, the board is going to open you cannot really add one percentage for one trade and another percentage for another trade right it's going to be fixed stop loss for all of the trades is this a problem not at all this is totally fine so here you have to add your stop loss percentage and here you can or you cannot add take profit target right it's completely up to you if you want to have a take profit target or no if you want to have a take profit target of let's say 1.5 percent this is basically going to be three to one rewards to risk right so if you end up right you're gonna make 1.5 percent gain if you end up wrong you're gonna lose half percent right so that's three to one rewards to risk you can do more right you can do four to one rewards to risk you can do higher it's really up to you or you can leave this right and not have take profit at all if you have a good indicator which is gonna be giving you exit signals right if that's the case then you can just leave this empty now here you guys have the option to choose pnl or price right so if you choose pnl right and your stop loss is half percent away basically when you lose half percent you're gonna be stopped out while if you select price right and there is a big difference here so you guys have to understand this if you select price and you select half percent then when the trade goes against you half of a percent that's when you're gonna be stopped out so it's completely up to you which option you guys want to choose i personally prefer price right i mean of course it depends on your strategy and how you are trading but i use price so it's gonna be half of a percent stop loss from the entry price that's pre pretty much it it's that easy to set up your bot all you have to do is click on create confirm right you can check here all the details confirm and bam your bot is up and running now what is important for you guys to understand is that even though the bot is up and running it's not gonna be taking any trades just yet right because you actually have to connect these bots to an indicator or trading view in order for the bot to start working because the reality is that the indicator or trading view is gonna be sending buy and sell signals to the bot basically it's gonna be sending signals in real time when exactly to buy and when exactly to sell and this by the way is pretty much the most crucial part 
of this whole thing. You guys gotta put your hands on a good and profitable trading view indicator, right? Which is gonna seed your bots with good signals. I personally use my own custom indicators, which you can see right here. These indicators are not free, but like I mentioned earlier, if you guys register on Blockfin using our link, if you then send us your ID, which you can get from right here, and if you deposit money to the Blockfin exchange and you actually start trading, you guys are gonna be included in a draw. So you're gonna have the chance to get access to our indicators for free. Now, what I wanna show you guys is how you can search for free trading view indicators, how you can test it and how you can find a good one that is gonna seed your bots, right? Because this again is the most crucial part. So you can go right here on trading view and indicators and strategies, right? And search for strategy, right? You can start that way. By doing this, you guys are gonna get a lot of indicators which you can test. Let's start with this first one just for you to get an idea. So you're gonna open the indicator, right? Then you're gonna go to a time frame that you guys wanna be trading, right? And you will and you're gonna be looking here at the strategy tester in order to figure out if this indicator is actually profitable. You can even go one step further, you can open the settings, you can go to properties, right? And you can add here your initial capital, right? So if you have a thousand dollars, you're gonna add here your initial capital and then you're gonna hit okay. This way you're gonna get more accurate data, right? So this strategy, the truth is that this strategy was going to lose you a lot of money, right? So this is definitely not an indicator that that you want to be using right so you're gonna have to do a little bit of work here guys in order to find a good indicator that you actually are gonna be comfortable using right so for example this one let's see this one on this specific time frame it generated four percent profit from like 1000 trades now this is very very low if you add here the commission which is normally like 0.20 percent or something like that it might be a little bit lower but if you add the commission for every trade, you guys see that this was actually going to generate a loss, right? So unfortunately, this indicator is not profitable. You guys are going to have to spend a little bit of time in order to find a good indicator. So let's see this one or let's actually find one with a lot of likes. So this one has like 22,000 likes. This is not a strategy, so you're not going to be able to test it. Therefore, we have to look for another one. To know which one is a strategy, you see this sign right here. That's what you have to be looking for. I just didn't notice that on this indicator that... Uh, they didn't really have this little icon right here. Wherever you see this icon, guys, this means that this indicator is actually a strategy. So you will be able to test it with the strategy tester, right? And to see what's the performance, right? So again, you're gonna have to scan through all of this indicator in order to find a good one. And this is basically gonna be the hardest part from this whole thing. Because again, this is the most crucial part. If you guys select an indicator that is losing money and if you connect it to your bots, well, unfortunately, you're gonna lose all of your money, right? So the, the most important part from this whole thing is for you guys to find a legit indicator. Once you do this, it literally takes a minute for you guys to connect your bot on the Bluffin Exchange to your indicator on TradingView so the bot can start earning you passive income. So let me show you how you do this. It is so freaking easy. So all you gotta do is just go back to the signal which you created right in this case we're gonna use the mmp 15 minutes so you have to click right here on more edit signal in order to find these two things that i mentioned earlier we're gonna need the webhook url and the alert message so first you're gonna copy the webhook url then you're gonna go back to trading view and you're gonna create an alert right using the indicator that you found so you're gonna go to these three dots right here, add alert, you're gonna go to notifications, you're gonna enable webhook URL and you're gonna paste, right, the Blockfin webhook URL. Then you're gonna go to the settings right here, you're gonna select order fields only and here where the message is, you're gonna get rid of all of that and you're gonna copy the message from Blockfin, right, this message, you're gonna copy it and paste it right here. Then you're just gonna hit create and there's gonna be a live connection between the indicator on trading view and your bot, right? So when the indicator generates a buy signal, it's gonna send it in real time and within seconds, the bot is gonna execute the trade. Then later on, when the indicator generates an exit signal, the same thing is gonna happen, right? Or it can generate multiple entries. It depends whatever on the strategy that you are using. And this is pretty much it, right? It's so freaking easy. It's just one part that is hard 
and that part is to find a good trading view indicator which is gonna be seeding your bots with signals so if you guys want to learn more about our indicators where we have a free web class where you're gonna learn everything that you guys need to know so all you gotta do to attend the web class is to go to our website satsincome.com click on free course right here add a name and email address and you're gonna get instant access that's pretty much it for this video boy b is checking out guys i'm actually back because there is something crucial that i forgot when you are setting up your alerts on trading view you have to make sure that you are actually looking at the bluffing chart right this is quite important because if you don't this, do this your bot might not work in the video i was showing you how to set up the bot and i forgot to switch from the binance chart to the bluffing chart right so keep in mind again you have to select the right chart so it's gonna be bitcoin usdt perpetual swap contract bluffing when you are setting up your alerts right quite an important piece that i forgot i apologize for that i love you guys